is up guys, it is Joe here from Joe Tilts Wrestling and at the time of this recording it is Christmas Day. Now I don't know when you guys are actually going to be seeing this video, however right now for me it is Christmas Day. I have this big box right here uh, that I know what's inside. It is a WWE Championship Spinner Belt replica and what I'm going to be doing today ladies and gentlemen is unboxing it right here on camera it is still wrapped up I haven't taken it out of its wrapping I knew I was getting this for Christmas um, and real quick I just want to say it is a used championship belt however it is in immaculate condition as if it has just come straight from WWE shop but what we're doing today ladies and gentlemen is we are unboxing it and then at some point in the future I will be doing a WWE championship spinner belt review uh, video where I go in depth taking a look at the championship but without further ado ladies and gentlemen let's get right into the unboxing okay guys I have the box right here we are literally just going to unwrap it right away it's not in the uh, official WWE box it is actually in the box uh, that was sent to me by uh, so Santa got me this used uh, but you know here we go I don't mind when you're when you get to my age of 18 uh, I technically qualify as an adult now which is scary uh, you don't get as many big presents anymore um, so this is really something that I'm very very grateful for uh, we're just going to throw the wrapping paper over there for now uh, the box is taped so I've got my scissors right here uh, we're literally is it yeah okay so we're literally just going to go and open this just carefully there we go and inside i can already see it is the wwe spinner championship right here and oh my god this is heavy wow this is heavy Jesus, guys, this is the, definitely by far the heaviest replica belt I own. I don't know if you guys can see the cabinet on camera, um, but I thought it was my Fandu Big Gold was the heaviest. But this spinner, wow, this is this has some weight to it. And this isn't even nearly close to the real weight of the real belt. But yeah, spinner championship, we've got it out of the box. Uh, and now it's time for me to unzip the belt. Okay, so here we are unzipping it right now it doesn't have it's uh, like clear plastic uh, cellophane to protect it on it because why would it it's used uh, but from uh, from what I can gather it has only been used for display purposes meaning it is literally brand new there's no stones missing there's no creases in the, uh, the fake leather it is immaculate and we're just gonna get this side out first gonna bring this side out and as we do ladies and gentlemen uh, in all of the belt videos you guys are gonna get to see it before I do so in three two one bang WWE championship spinner belt this is the belt of my childhood and it oh wow wow this is incredible Guys, I have wanted this championship since I became a wrestling fan in late 2010. And this was the championship I saw. Believe it or not, a lot of you guys think I got into wrestling a lot sooner. I didn't. Uh, when I got into wrestling, The Miz was the WWE champion. No. Randy Orton was the WWE champion. And uh, he had just lost the belt to The Miz. The Miz was the champion when I became like a full-time watching Raw Every Week wrestling fan. And now I finally have the championship that I've wanted my whole life. Um, and funnily enough, ladies and gents, I'm going to roll this clip. It's Christmas Day. Ten years ago, Christmas Day 2010, I got the Mattel WWE Kids Spinner Belt. Roll the clip. And here we are, 10 years later, I have the WWE official metal replica WWE championship spinner. This is amazing. I can't believe this, guys. Honestly, I've wanted this so long. 
Uh, there might be a few modifications that I make to it uh, in the future. I'm not too sure. The leather is not creased at all. Uh, whoever sent me this, whoever had this before me, took really, really good care of this. And uh, I'm very, very thankful because of that. It will be going in my cabinet. I'm just yet to decide which place I want it to put it on, which shelf. Um, so there is a few inaccuracies and a few things that... Are, uh, that do bother me about this championship, uh, one of which is the edges of the side plates, and all, and all the main plates, sorry, they are plated in gold, the real spinner was plated in nickel on the edges, uh, I've seen you can get some Neverdoll, which is like an abrasive polish, and just like scrub it off, but I'm not sure how well that works on the newer replicas, we may do that in the future, but for now, guys, this has been my WWE Spinner Championship uh, unboxing on Christmas Day, opening it from a present, to a championship. I will be releasing an in-depth review of this championship at some point in the near future, uh, probably after New Year, probably one of the first videos in the New Year. So if you are looking forward to that, let me know. We will be doing that video very, very shortly. But for now, I hope you guys have enjoyed. I've been Joe from Joe Talks Wrestling. You guys have been awesome. Stay tuned for more wrestling related content and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye. Fire!